Hey guys, connecting your AI agents to any tools has never been easier with Model Context Protocol, MCP. Now, all you need to do is to bring URL representing an MCP server, and your AI agents will instantly unlock access to data and actions in thousands of apps. In this video, let me show you how you can connect your MyPal AI agents to thousands of apps on Zapier via their MCP. First, we would need to set up our Zapier MCP server. Let's go here and you will land at your Zapier MCP settings page where you will get a unique MCP server endpoint here uh, representing your own MCP server. In this MCP server, you can edit MCP actions. Essentially, all the actions that your AI agent should have access to when you using this MCP server. Now, there are thousands of apps on Zapier that you can choose from. So depending on the job you want to, your AI agent to do, you uh, should provide them the relevant um, tools and actions. All you need to do is to add new action here. Type to search for thousands of apps and actions, such as send email, get keywords, connect to Notion, and so much more. For now, I'm planning to give, um, to give uh, this MCP server to my blog post writer AI agent on MyPal. So I will assign the relevant actions to this agent. In this case, it would be the ability to create new Google Docs document from text to save the content of any new blog post it writes, as well as append text to document in case the document is a big one and we need to add content one chunk by one. I will also uh, allow this agent to have access to my MyPub blog post spreadsheet, uh, which contains all of the um, blog post ideas already existing in MyPub CMS, as you can see here, so that the AI agent will know what is already there and generate unique, fresh ideas for me only. Now that my Zapier MCP is ready, Let's go copy this URL and bring it into my blog post writer agent on my pal. Here, this is my blog post writer agent. I can go into its settings, go to the MCPs tab and add a new SSC MCP server named Zapier with the exact URL provided by Zapier here. Now I can add the server and my pal will automatically test the connection to this MCP for me. And as you can see, all I need to do is to provide a URL and my pal has already got the access to these four actions that I have configured in my Zapier MCP settings. Now let's save this agent. Now here comes the fun part. Let's try this AI agent with its MCP access out and see if it is able to have access to my apps. Uh, first, I want this AI agent to brainstorm 10 new blog post ideas based on what it knows about my pal. Make sure to cross check the Google Sheet for um, already existing ideas and return only fresh, unique ideas. Let's go. Now, as you can see, the agent is calling the Google Sheets Get Many Roles tool from Zapier to check what's already on the list. And then it has just cooked up some fresh ideas for my blocks, as you can see here. All of these 10 ideas are all new compared to um, the existing ones in our CMS. The cool thing about this is that because my MyPal blog post writer has access to the entire MyPal documentation, it also has really deep understanding of MyPal in order to come up with very relevant and meaningful ideas, such as when AI needs a hand designing workflows with human checkpoints in MyPal, which explores our human input node and human in the loop design, and many more. Uh, I really like this idea, so I will choose this idea and ask my MyPal blog post writer to write a blog post about this. Okay, 
Now here is the blog post generated by my uh, MyPal blog post writer about the topic that I have selected. This is pretty good. So now I want this agent to save the content into a Google Docs. So let's ask it to do just that. Let's go. And now the AI agent has used my Google Docs create document from text to initiate a new Google Docs document, as you can see here. And now the document is created. It will append the content. Since the blog post is quite long, uh, we need to append the, the content chunk by chunk like this so Google Docs can handle. And now the agent is done. The blog post has been saved. And here's the ID of the Google Docs where you can use to check this. And here it is. This is the exact blog post that we have just created with the MyPal blog post writer agent. So cool, right? Now with the same logic, you can let your AI agents uh, read data and take actions across even more apps and not just for blog posts related tasks, but also any other tasks uh, in your business that you want. You can even turn this whole process into multi-agent workflow on MyPal so that every time you want to do something, instead of instructing the agent step by step like this, you can just pre-train the whole process and uh, just run the workflow with one click to get all of these, these results in one go. That's it for today's video. Hope you find this tutorial helpful and uh, can't wait to see what, what your AI agents do, can now do with the power of MCP.